First on our list of content delivery networks that we can use to go live to our website is Castor.io. Castor.io has been around for a long time. I've been using it to transfer videos from place to place, but now they have an HTML5 embeddable video player, and that makes all the difference. So how do we go about connecting to Castor? Let's do it step by step, shall we? If I click on set broadcast, I've chosen custom RTMP. And let's go over to the Castor website. And this is my account on the Castor website. And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my stream. And you can see that I've set it up to go to Twitter and to Twitch, but also you can go to my website. Now in order to do that, I need the RTMP feed, which is there. And I'm going to copy that into my studio and paste it. Okay, then I go back <laughs> to get the streaming key. Remember, it's in two parts. It is the um, URL, which we've got, and the streaming key. There's the only two pieces of information that you need for our purposes to go live to your website. So I'm going to copy that link, come back to my studio, key the link in by pasting it and save. Okay, so that broadcast is now set up. Now I don't need, I can't, because I'm broadcasting to an RTMP site, I cannot do the following, and you've got to bear this in mind. I cannot set a title or a description. I cannot see comments whilst I'm live in my studio. That's the downside, but the upside is you're broadcasting live to your website in 1080p in high definition, and you're going to get a quality video. So I've keyed those two pieces of information into, I've got the URL, I've got a string key. Okay. I've saved that. It says all changes successfully saved. So we're using Castor.io to stream to our website. Let's go live. What could possibly go wrong? So I'm going to start the broadcast and you confirm it. And we're now in negotiation. Uh, we've, our signal from this studio is going to be live and it's arrived on BeLive and it's then going to go from BeLive to Castor.io and we go over to the Castor.io site and we shall see it. Uh, so I'm waiting, it takes about 20 seconds for the feed to go through but once it's there then that's it, job done. Now when you're broadcasting do make sure that the feed is actually working by opening the site and it's waiting for a stream. So it's beginning now. So there's my camera going through and in a second we should have from the studio. Right, so the signal is leaving this studio and it's going over to Castor.io. Let's go to Castor.io, which is that one. And you can see the signal is actually being received in the studio. And if we go over to the website, if we go to the website, we can see that it's refreshing and it will come through in a second. And there we have the live feed actually on the website. If you're watching live, thank you. Um, and this is basically on the live video training testing website. One, two, three, testing one, two, three. And I'm going to turn the volume off because I don't have any conflict. So let's turn the volume off because you've got to remember that even though even though this is not going to Facebook or YouTube, it's going to the website, there is processing involved and it takes time to this, for the signal to leave your studio and be received and processed by Castor.io. That's all you need to do. And I'll show you how to embed the player uh, in your website in the next lesson. But Castor.io is so simple and straightforward, you go over to Castor, you get, uh, go there again, you get the RTMP server key and you get 
the streaming key, you put them in your BitLife Studio, press the button to go live, and voila, you are live on your website and you can see the broadcast information. And it's telling me that I've got one person watching, so thank you for watching. And you can confirm uh, how much of your bandwidth has been taken up, what you're broadcasting. So we're going 1920, 1080p, as I said earlier, and we're at 30 FPS, which is the standard for live broadcasts with uh, normal machines. So it's so simple. If I scroll down, you will see that you have the iframe widget, which you copy the code, embed that into your blog post or to your website uh, page. So you've got a choice page or blog post. And once you've done that, every time you go live, you'll be live on that page, just as we are live on this page right now. I've um, This is part of a blog post and you can see at the top we have uh, about the show and we have videos and the live feed is coming in at the bottom of the screen and anybody watching live now uh, thank you and I've got below that as you can see Facebook comments so if you're watching live please leave a comment I'll go back this is amazing technology that video is 1080p crystal clear and uh, as is the sound and I just well you can probably tell by now I actually think that broadcasting to your website is the future that's how easy it is to do it on Castor Castor is available from $50 per month and for that you can live stream two live streams um, as you can see if I go back on the web page I've got the ability to do this, which is Stephen 1, also have Stephen 2, and going live on Caster to the world whenever you wish. This has been Stephen in the BeLife Studio. I'll see you all again soon.